Courtney, you are the new WBA bantamweight champion of the world after a thrilling, thrilling fight. Your reaction when David Diamante read the cards out there said it all. Please just try to put into words how you're feeling right now. Uh, I can't. Um, amazing, amazing. I don't want to cry, but amazing. It was an all-action fight from start to finish. It was 100 miles an hour in there at times, but do you feel it was the cleaner work that, that won you yeah. the fight tonight? I feel like my jab won me in the fight, to be honest. And um, my conditioning, my attrition, you know, all the hard, hard work. Them two, my, my coaches, Charlie and H, they kill me on a daily basis. And Troy, Sully, Joe, Adam, everyone, they kill me in the gym. And it, I stand there and I hate them for a bit, bloody paid off, because... My nice jab and my fitness and my conditioning won me this fight. There was so much back and forth between yourself and Ebony in fight week and after all the hype, all the build-up, that fight certainly delivered, didn't it? It certainly did. Um, I, I have to give credit to her because that was a bloody good fight and she was tougher than I thought she was. But I knew, I knew if, my bo if I sucked my box and I'd win, I had to keep listening to Charlie because he kept saying box, box, box. And when I was getting into like a war, it was stupid of me because I know my boxing beat her and that's what won. The jab won me in a fight. Is there respect there? Now Ebony showed tremendous bravery like yourself. She was very tough. Is there respect between the pair of you now? There was respect before I got in the ring because anybody that gets in the ring deserves respect. But putting up the performances she just did, I actually have now more respect for her. We know the message heading into the fight was always just to stick to the game plan, not to fight on emotion. It was a shootout at times, but you must be so proud of yourself that you've held your nerve in there. When it was a shootout, that was my own stupidity. My team so told me, don't fight on emotion, don't think, feel, and that's exactly what I did. And when I didn't get drawn in and didn't act stupid, I won with a nice jab, just kept popping the jab. You saw the size of her eye afterwards. During the week, we talked about the Shannon Courtney of seven years ago who was lying in a hospital bed, who was battling her own demons. To be stood in front of me tonight as a world champion, you must be incredibly proud of your journey. Yeah, I've come a long way, you know. I've said it all week. I was a young, stupid, naive girl who I made severe mistakes. And, you know, I think tonight is proof that anyone can turn their life around, you know, and I did that. I've, I'm a different person who I once was. And I always said, don't judge me my past, judge me who I am now. And if you still want a judgment who I once was, you know, everyone makes mistakes. I'm a new person. I found the Lord, I found boxing, and I'm a world champion, baby. How long do you think it's going to take to settle in uh, what you've just achieved tonight? I don't. And trust me when I say this, I'm wearing this everywhere. As did food shopping on my shoulder. <laughs> Going to the dentist, I'll be wearing it. I'm going to have to take it everywhere because this is such a proud moment for me. Such a proud moment. And for my family, for my mum, this is such a great example to young girls as well that you can turn your life around and... I'm just, I can't put it into words. Another brilliant showcase for women's boxing as well, once again. Yeah. Um, I just, uh, you said that winning this belt was just the beginning for you. Rachel Ball was watching along on Sky Live tonight. She was meant to be in the opposite co uh, corner. We, of course, wish her well, but is that the, the natural fight for you to make next against Rachel Ball? Yes. And, and that's the fight you believe we will see next, the, the rematch? Yes. And uh, just finally, Shan, I want to leave the final word to you um, for the people who have bounce back from the depths like you have to be stood here today. For all of those who have stuck by you, to your family, I just wonder if you have any final messages to add tonight. Uh, it's never too late to turn your life around and, you know, anyone can achieve anything. you just got to, you know, be good. Shannon, you should be incredibly proud of yourself and the new. Yeah. And the well new. Done. Thank you. Well done.